super easy. This is a tailgate for our Ford pickup truck. Measure the height, the longest side, 55. And get your weight, this one was 33. It scales off now. Now we're going to Grian's website. You can log in. You want to do some mine because you save a lot of money. Okay, and then Greyhound shipping. We definitely need the shipping site because it's a different one. Log in. Super easy. Now your biggest measurement, your height, and your zip code. Hers is in that range. Put her zip code to from. So you have to know is the zips, the longest weight, the dimension. Um, if we ship it via internet, it's $80, $90. Ship it up door to station. And if you walk up, it'll be 118 so you get like a 30%, 20% discount. And Greyhound only works station to station for the most part, so you have to bring it in. So there's our station. We're going to Gary, Indiana. And yeah. You didn't, I guess that's it. Always make sure your Greyhound takes packages. Some will not take packages. They only take people. Uh, he's got to go 30 miles. Not my problem. Greyhounds are not always in there. Declared value. Quote, $90. And we just put all this in. She's uh, just took a big box we found dumpster diving. Taped it around there. It doesn't need to be around the edges. We took crap, uh, some saran wrap I found on the tree crap, put it around there. I just got to fix that. Put extra labels on the front and on the back. Remember, this is hiding behind shrink wrap. They might not be able to scan it. So that's why I put one kind on the outside. I'm not going to leave the shrink wrap around there. And the labels been taped on really good. So now off to Prion. Here's the second side. In this thing, I flip the box upside down, inside out. So I don't see any other crappy stuff on there. And I tried to tape over where the staples were because usually when you put boxes, you got to glue or staple them. So she's glued and I taped all the end. So remember, they're going to beat the crap out of this thing. And the saran wrap just to keep the cardboard on there to give it a little cushion. It's a car part, so it doesn't really matter too bad. Easy it is, we're at the Greyhound bus terminal. We're going to drop it off. Oh, there's a train up there too. South Shore. And uh, we've got cardboard wrapped around it, not the top and bottom, we don't care. Saran wrap and like, three labels on it on both sides, so in case they lose one label. So now we're going to drop it off inside and be done. There is inside, so we're just going to walk inside and drop it off in the boat. Should be like 53 on the length. This is the South Shore train that's going to Chicago. This is downtown Gary. Greyhound likes to use other people's bus terminals, which is probably fine. There's the city center of Gary. City Bank building over there. And we got a receipt. It's got a real tracking number you can track on Greyhound's website. It tells us what we paid and all that. They put a different receipt on there, a different tracking number. And actually, we missed the tracking by the train or bus by a couple of minutes, probably filming this video. So hopefully this gives you an idea how easy to ship. And you see we didn't wrap it the strongest, and we put labels on multiple things, especially if it's heavy to great on drivers that want to turn it upside down, move while they're um, going around about their business, make it easy for them. And um, if you like it, please give a thumbs up. Please help subscribe. That helps throw a couple dollars in <laughs> uh, lunch fun. And uh, we'll see you again on next time.